Hey, what's up everybody? Dave back with Nice Bricks here to talk to you today about the top five Lego Star Wars sets for you to invest in. Let's get into it. A lot of nice sets on the market right now. Some retiring soon, some yet to come to market. A couple disclaimers. Set cannot be retired at this point. So still active on the shelves, right? You can still buy it in certain places. Second, we're avoiding any UCS sets. Obviously, the Ultimate Collector Series sets are amazing. You want to collect them. You want to invest them. They cost an arm and a leg. But we're going to keep them off the list, all right? So let's start with number one. And why wouldn't it be? Dark Lord of the Sith, Darth Vader's helmet. A couple of people have asked me why this set, and I say why not. Details on this set. It's set number 75304. Comes in at 834 pieces and regularly priced $79.99. Now, what I like about this set is the helmet, the size, the scale, it is Darth Vader. And when you look after market, Iron Man, Boba Fett, the TIE Fighter pilot, those are all selling well above what you would expect them to be. I think I just sold an Iron Man set a couple weeks ago, the helmet, like $180, probably paid $50 for it. So. If that's any indication, expect this Vader helmet to do really, really well in the aftermarket and scoop it up. Set number two, Republic Fighter Tank. Now, I don't have one to show you because I'm not a fan of this set myself, and I usually only invest in sets that I'm a fan of. I'm just not a fan of this build. However, what I will tell you is Republic Fighter Tanks do well aftermarket. This one comes with a brand new Mace Windu and 187 clone troopers. So when I think 187, I think little Dr. Dre, a little Snoop, a little deep cover, if you know that what I'm talking about there. But this set will do well for you aftermarket. It comes in at $39.99, $40, dollars so it's not that bad. 282 pieces. Um, so you're getting the clones that you want, and I know everybody out there likes to collect new clones when they find them. You can get them here, and of course, a cool Mace Windu is gonna make that set that much better. So if you can find this one on the shelves, you can maybe find it on sale on Amazon, I'd say scoop it up. But as far as the build goes and the set itself, not a huge fan, not for me, uh, but worthwhile to invest in. And like I said, comes in at $39.99. Uh, decent price, a little overpriced for the pieces, but I think that has to do with the mace window you're getting and the clone troopers. And I can tell you those clone troopers after market already are selling for $11, $12, $13. So right there, you're gonna get three clone troopers, and if you were to sell those, you're already making your money back on the set, let alone selling a Mace Windu. If you're if you're into the aftermarket minifigures, I'm not, I sell sets, but some facts just to help you with your investments. Set number three, Princess Leia, Return of the Jedi, Bounty Hunter Helmet, because why not? I gotta tell you, I bought three or four of these already. I saw them go out of stock on Lego, and I put them on Amazon and they were selling for well over $100. So to me, that's an indication that even aftermarket, because of the uniqueness of this set, that it is Princess Leia, it is her bounty hunter, it is from Return of the Jedi, this one is gonna kill aftermarket. So if you can find it, good luck. First off, I, I can't find it anymore, but if you can find it when Lego has it back in stock, you need to get your hands on it. One, because it's great for the collector, Two, you're gonna do really, really well on this one. Quick details, this is set number 75351, 670 pieces, and comes in at $70. So I like the price to piece ratio. To me, that's good, a lot better than the Republic Fighter Tank. So this one's more worth your money. Uh, and trust me, it will sell for you once it's retired with ease. Set four, again, no order, just set four in my list of five. The ATTE Walker that just came out a couple months ago. Um, this one's amazing because it's got the only Phase 2 Commander Cody. You get four to five clone troopers, uh, which again, aftermarket or clone collectors are going to gobble this up. And the ATTE Walkers, again, do exceptionally well aftermarket. So if you can find this one, it sells for about $140. i would say get it. Uh, they always do well after market. You might have to hold on to this one a little bit longer than some other sets. However, you're definitely going to make your money back. These sets always do well because there are collectors that want every generation of Walker. And I think this might be the fourth one, um, including the one from Rebels that Lego has produced. This might be the fourth one. 
Um, no prominent figures outside of Phase 2 Cody, but again, it's Cody. It's the only Phase 2 you're going to find of Cody, and you're getting five other or five total clone troopers in this set. So great to the collection. Will do well after market. Details on this set, it's set number 75337, 1,082 pieces, and comes in at about hundred and right at $140. I'm not happy with the price to piece ratio. I might wait for this one to go on sale. Uh, when it does, I'm gonna scoop it up, but probably wait for this one to go on sale. You will make your money back. No worries. Set number five, one of my favorites. Obi-Wan's, I got it backwards. Obi-Wan's Jedi Starfighter. Um, when I first saw this set, not a huge fan of it, right? It, it's small, it's compact, but it's a Starfighter anybody tell me when you've seen a starfighter not do well after market this one being obi-wan uh from uh the clone wars uh from attack of the clones i believe it's the first time we get a kaminoan minifigure at least one with this much detail and you get r5 what is it r4 p17 droid in there also our fighters do really really well you're getting an attack of the clones obi-wan so you get a little bit longer hairstyle with him cool minifig you're getting the Kamino in, and you're getting the Droid. All three are going to do well independently after market, but specifically Starfighters do really, really well. Take a look at Yoda Starfighter, Anakin's older Starfighters. Those things are going for quadruple, triple, if not more than what their original value was. Now, this one sells for $30. Um, you can find that on Amazon usually for $24, $23.99. And if you can, scoop it up, hold on to it. It's going to do great after market. Um, and it's a Starfighter. You can't go wrong with Starfighters, ever. Details, 75333 is a set number, 282 pieces. And like I said, $29.99 is its retail price. Uh, usually you can find it on sale on Amazon for $23.99, $24. And scoop it up if you can. It's an Obi-Wan Starfighter. Can't go wrong. We got a bonus! I said five. I'm lying. We're going to do six today. Look at this set, Heroes of Endor Brickheads, man. This one is a collector's dream. You got Luke, Lando, Leia, Wicked the Ewok, and an R2 to round it out. So you're getting five total Brickheads. You're getting Jedi Master Luke, you're getting Millennium Falcon Lando from Turn of the Jedi, and you're getting Endor Leia. Amazing, amazing to add to anybody's collection. Throw in R2, throw in a cool little Wicked with his spear, Collector's dream, man. You can't go wrong with this one. So scoop these up. I got mine. Uh, the May the 4th be with you week from Lego. I bought a few of them myself. Um, I can't wait to put this one together, but this is definitely something to add to your collection for an investor and for yourself. Find it, buy it, keep it, store it, save it, build it, do whatever you want with it. But make sure you have your hands on this set, especially if you're looking to invest. It's set number 40623. 549 pieces, and I think it retails for $39.99. Um, so you're getting five minifigures, or, or excuse me, you're getting five brick heads for $40. Investor's dream. Get it, buy it, keep it, build it, do whatever you want with it. It's going to sell like hotcakes. No worries with that one. All right, those are my top five with the bonus brick heads. Thanks for coming. Thanks for watching the channel. If you think anything different, any other set belongs there, put it in the comments below. Hit me up with a like and subscribe, and we'll see you the next time. All right, take care. Nice bricks out.